Well, here we are. Are you gonna drive? I would love to drive, except my legs are too long. Yeah. I totally just turned it off yep. with my knee. You sure did. I'm gonna take this the wrong way, but uh, I like to sit next to Lindsay you know, a little more. <laughs> hey, yeah, We're talking you know about what? a brand new song <laughs> that I just heard from my record. Yes. Rep, is with ESPN. What's yeah, going ESPN on with that? It, uh, it's called Angels in This Town, and first, first, the uh, verses. Hail Mary touchdown, you caught it, don't know how, but you felt something lift you up a little bit higher. So we got a little football in there. And uh, that was kind of a true story about a guy in my hometown in Texas that went up for a ball at a playoff game. And no one really knows how he got up that high. Or how he got the ball. But, uh, I mean, it's mainly the, 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 the song, I believe that, you know, some miracles can happen. I don't know why or why not. And uh, just that's kind of what the song's about. And also, there's a lot of people in every town that create miracles. We're getting to go thank a lot of them. We're at a Habitat for Humanity build, uh, police officers, EMS, firefighters, like military. And it's pretty much everybody that, that does things that we aren't capable of doing and helping us out. And uh, so, we're getting to go out on the road, people call them angel visits. And uh, that's kind of deeper into just every day in my life of getting to do stuff. But Angels in This Town is a new song, and it's kind of letting us branch out and do that. So, and you were an angel in our town today. Yeah, I was going to tell you. Talk about that. Well, I, we went to Habitat for Humanity uh, house. And I, uh, it was like the final day. They gave the, the house to the family, but I, I felt I told everybody I felt bad because I hadn't worked on the house and I'm here <laughs> donating it. Like you're welcome, but I hadn't. I didn't even paint anything, which I love doing that stuff. I'm so excited for you, Tara, and, and just a, what a cool thing to make sure people have a great home and. Uh, just thank y'all. That's why we're here, just to say thank you and promote good because there's good everywhere, you know. Thank you very much for the uh, Kubota conversation. Yeah, yeah, this is a fancy vehicle. It is. It's sweet. I could drive this. I think it's because there's three of us sitting in here. I'll get out. Well, now here are you. All right. I got to do Lindsay you out. You get out. That didn't sound right. Yeah, it didn't. Get out. All right, get out. Cruising over there. Sure, you can go over there if you want. Should I go on high or low? You're high class, so go high. Yeah, my wife and I just got a contract on 40 acres. And this would work I've well, honestly, right? I've honestly been looking online all week at these and tractors and all that stuff. And you can turn the radio on. This is fancy. This is a super fancy one. And nice and air. This is fancy. It, it, it's our sponsor. It gives it to us to use so we can drive sure around. And yeah. Wow. Just Will for they the day. sponsor me to drive around 40 acres? Um, I don't know. You'd have to talk to Art White. He's, he's a pretty nice guy. He just yeah. might, actually. Like, is there like an artist discount? I used to be broke and now I'm not. Yeah, I was going to say. Not as broke. 